Lisa. Oh, dinner's for the week. Just like mix it all together, I think. <laughs> I want what you want. We're just one thing. The game. pressure's <laughs> off. This will be you, Betcha. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Don't mind them anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jess. Is Sauce that wrong? Me. Absolutely not. <sighs> the what? <laughs> why but today i have just been so unmotivated can you see that my period is two days away explains a lot i'm currently in the gym car park it is 2 2 40 p.m <laughs> i have been semi no i haven't been productive but i was determined to turn the day around so i managed to get myself to the gym honestly this is the last thing i feel like doing right now and it's lower body day as well but we got here. That's what matters. I just figure, even if I don't have the best session ever, I'm just going to walk in. I don't care how long it is. I don't care if I don't lift my heaviest. I just want to get in and move my body. Because I know I will feel better afterwards. Do you know what I mean? I saw this TikTok yesterday, which made me laugh so much. And that just made me think of it when I was like, do you know what I mean? Um, oh my goodness. It's a phrase that you say so excessively that now it's just become part of your everyday vocabulary. For me, it's... Do you know what I mean? Maybe it's too hot to go for a walk today. Do you know what I mean? I have to clean my room today, but I just can't be bothered. Do you know what I mean? And I've used it for so long that now... Me. I need to stop saying, do you know what I mean? Anyway. Rule number one. I just really want my period to come, so I just stop feeling unmotivated. I also peeled off all of my nail polish yesterday. You know when one starts to lift, and so you just peel them all off? That's kind of what happened. And I feel like my nails are at a really good length at the moment. I'm thinking after the gym I might go get them done because I don't want them to break and then be a bad length for when I do get them done. I was so close to saying, do you know what I mean then? I really had to hold that in. <laughs> oh, I don't want to go to the gym. No, I can do this. Oh, number one. I also, okay, maybe it's just something you guys can help me with. I just don't love any music at the moment. I feel like I go through phases where I'm like obsessed with 10 songs and I just have them constantly playing and then I just get over them and so I'm kind of like I don't even have a good workout playlist so if you have any re song recommendations don't even have to be for gym just like great songs please leave them below because I just need some I just need some good songs and then maybe I can make a playlist for us all and then we can all listen to it okay I'm just gonna walk in do a warm-up and then start wish me luck <laughs> Literally three minutes, I want to say, of curtsy lunges. Just body weight. <sighs> really got me puffing. Oh, got to stop. All right, so I was there for 57 minutes total. Pretty good, pretty good. I am so glad that I went. <laughs> I knew I would say that. I definitely didn't go as heavy as I have gone before. But as I said before, that was never my goal. My whole goal for that session was to just go. <laughs> and we did that. So I'm happy. I was doing... 50 kilo squats i did five sets and even on like the second set i was like this feels so heavy how did i ever do 75 kilos <laughs> the week that i did that was the week after period week that is always the ideal training week let's be honest i really need to wash my hair as well look at that oh it's currently 8 30 p.m this is terrible lighting but i got my nails done <laughs> i got this like taupe kind of color supernatural 
I love them. I had some dinner and I've actually just been editing my vlog, which is now scheduled for tomorrow morning, which is so good. I really didn't think I was going to get it done, but I managed to somehow. I've also been watching Sex and the City. I have actually watched it before the series and I loved it. So I decided I would start it again. It's really like feel good show. I was watching Pretty Little Lies and <laughs> I'm home alone because Sam is working and I just feel like when I watch Pretty Little Lies too late at night, especially if I'm home alone, just gets a bit too much, <laughs> freaks me out a bit. I look very tired because I am. Video is scheduled now so I feel like I can relax. I'm going to make my way to bed, brush my teeth, maybe do a bit of reading and then get a pretty early night. So I will see you in the morning. Welcome back to another episode of Drink More Water. Also, <laughs> I want to adjust one thing. <laughs> so true. Because I woke up and I was like, oh, I feel so inspired. And I came out and I wrote my business goals for the next five years. <laughs> Be followers. <laughs> How do you feel the podcast went out of 10? Oh, so good. It was a good episode, wasn't it? It was a really good episode. Yeah. Like this one. We pretty much just had a conversation and a catch up. We did. We didn't plan it at all. Do you want to let them all know what kind of position you're in at the moment? <laughs> <laughs> I need a <mark. laughs> Enjoy your walk and say hi to the little schmoke. I will. Whip. Goodbye. Today, I have had a very emaily admin day. It's kind of just been like everyone's been on their emails today, so I feel like I've just been going back and forth a lot, which is actually great because it just kind of sorts a lot of things out. I also, yeah, you can definitely see, I got sunburnt on my walk this morning. I feel like I got a bit of color, and now my foundation, oh, this is a BB cream actually. It doesn't match my body. No, but I am so excited actually because this arrived in the post today and basically I've been wanting a new camera for a while. I do love the one I'm using right now. The one I'm using right now is the Canon G7X Mark III. I do love it. I feel like it's a classic one for vlogging, but there's been a few things that I don't love about it, specifically the focus. Oh, that's another email. Just a few other things. And I did want to try something new. Do you know what I mean? So I bought the Sony ZV-1. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. My friend Connor uses this. And on the Byron ship, she was showing me basically how it worked and said that she loved it. So I was very convinced by her. So I decided to give it a go. Plus, it has this little, I think it's actually called a windscreen. But I call it a little like fluff or a muffler. I thought we would do a bit of a test. So I'm currently on my old camera, G7X, and I thought I would swap it over to this one. So keen to see the difference. And if you guys can tell a massive difference, definitely let me know. I don't know how the audio is gonna sound. I don't know how the lighting's gonna be. I've tried to play around with the settings a little bit. I'm a bit confused, but yeah, let's give it a go. Three, two, one, boom. <laughs> That was the worst transition I've ever done in my life, well aware. Okay, I am now on the new camera. I'm. It's gonna take me a long time to get used to this, but the viewfinder is to the side of the camera. So with the G7X, it flips up. So often I will look at myself instead of the camera, but you can't really tell. Or sorry, instead of the lens. But yeah, you can't really tell. But with this, when I don't look at the lens, I look like this. <laughs> so it's actually gonna be really good because I need to be so much more aware of where I'm looking. If I'm walking around, I feel like the stabilization on it 
is very good. Also, don't mind the mess on the table. I need to stop looking in the viewfinder. Ah! So I feel like I'm staring into your soul right now. It's so weird to me that I'm looking into a camera lens right now and then I upload it. And then you on the other side of your computer screen are watching that. Blows my mind. <laughs> Apparently it's not the best in low light. It doesn't really correct itself for a bit as we can see. There we go. Yeah, I think I like it. Obviously I really can't tell until I look at the footage. But definitely let me know which footage you prefer. If you prefer Canon or Sony, because I'd be very interested to see. Also, I know I'm, I mean, everyone who's watching this is gonna be like, Sophie, I, have, I wear them every day. This is nothing new. But I have had to buy some face masks because I'm actually going away next week and you need to wear masks in airports at all time and on planes as well. Honestly, where I have lived has been so incredibly lucky. We've actually never had to wear masks, um, but obviously when traveling, you need to wear them. But I got some from Cotton On. As much as they're like pretty, I tried it on. I was just kind of like, yeah, fine. And then I got some Gymshark ones and these are by far so much more comfortable. So much better than these. I feel like if you are wearing them a lot, you want a really comfortable one. So I highly recommend these Gymshark ones. I'll try and link them below. Alrighty, it is now 6.17 p.m. And it has finally come to the time. Come to the time? Come to the time? To try the famous TikTok pasta. Tomatoes, olive oil, salt, and pepper to a baking dish. Then add a block of fennel. 200. I think I'm just gonna use this. Cherry tomatoes. I got. Oh, has that got mold on it? Yeah. <laughs> is that enough? That's all we've got, so I hope so. Pop that in. A bit of olive oil. Do you have any full garlic? Just this, like, minced garlic, but I'm sure it. I mean, it does the same thing, right? Bake it 400 for 35 minutes. 35 minutes, okay. Just gonna add some salt and some pepper. See how she goes, okay. In the oven. Set a timer for 35 minutes. Timer is set for 35 minutes. Perfect. I suppose when it gets to about 10 minutes to go, I'll put the pasta on. But so far, I'm loving this recipe because it is so simple. <laughs> Fresh. Basil it smells incredible, doesn't it? Fresh basil is so good. Just like mix it all together, I think. Oh, I feel like that's supposed to break more. I feel like this is gonna be really good. It smells pretty damn good. I'm so hungry. Oh, well, 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 well. Are you hungry? Nah. Like, not so hungry. I've got the pasta. I might have cooked way more than we actually need. So I'm just gonna start off with. Oh, I wasn't even filming it. Time for the taste test. This is the finished result. Three, two, one. That is incredible. That tastes like something you'd get at a restaurant. Now I don't know what all the hype was about. You don't? I oh, do. you do, yeah. yeah. There was so much hype, I was like, ah, oh, just fair cheese it's, and some It was so easy. It like, it took easy. 30 minutes in the oven, but you literally just mix things together yeah. and chuck it in the oven. Oh my goodness. This is definitely going to become a regular. Do not. We are going to put some new girl on the TV because we're obsessed. Very ideal situation right now. By the way, that sounds from last night. I'm not having a beer as well. What is happening? Dinner is done. It was incredible. I'm not gonna lie. I've just sat here with the fork and had some more. I've actually been liking these Fit Pro ice creams. I'm also going to make myself an adrenal switch just because my period is due tomorrow, I think, or today. And the adrenal is a really good source of magnesium. And I always feel like my cramps are so much better when I have a lot of magnesium in my body. Also, it just helps me sleep. Good morning. It is nine o'clock. Wow, this morning has flown by. I woke up about five to Sam coming in the room being like, my car's not starting. So I actually ended up driving him and dropping him at work. Then I came home and did some stories for Gymshark. Still baffles me two things. One, that I'm a Gymshark athlete. I, I don't think I'll ever get over that. <laughs> and two, how long those kind of things take. I feel like I'm always like, oh, pump it out in like 10, 20 minutes. Definitely always takes over an hour. <laughs> Bunch of new sports bras have actually launched, or are launching, sorry, tonight, which by the time you guys are watching this video, they'll already be launched. I don't want to flash you, but 
I'm wearing one of my faves right now. Love it. I will add them all to my Gymshark Fits highlight on Instagram. So if you are watching this video now and missed it, you can still go check out my Instagram. But I'm currently outside of the shops. It is raining, so I very, very luckily scored a park just there you go, just outside the door. I've come here for one reason, one reason alone. I've run out of oat milk. <laughs> I have also brought a bag, which is probably a bad idea, to be honest, because I'll know that I have a bag. Therefore, I can fill it more. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, I'm going to go in, grab my oat milk, maybe a couple of extra things. You never know. Maybe I should put a limit on what I can get. Three things, max. Yes. Should I get two? I'm going to stock up and get two. <laughs> sitting right by the tripod just staring right up at me thought i would give you guys a really quick try on haul of some of my favorite things that are going to be in the after pay day gymshark sale all of my favorite things from gymshark are in this sale starting off with what i'm wearing right now i've got the black fraction top on i cannot even begin to describe how much i love these in general i feel like they are so flattering they're so comfy i I would wear this every single day if I could, and I basically do, in every single colour. I'll put all the discounts for each item on the screen, but this one is going to be 10% off. And we also have the shorts I'm wearing. These ones, they are my favourite, along with the Vital Seamless shorts, which I'm about to show you as well because they are on sale. I think they're so comfy. They're very, very flattering. I think they're probably the most flattering shorts along with the Vital Seamless. I literally alternate between these and the Vital Seamless shorts every single day of the week. I don't like leggings personally. Well, in winter I do, but in summer you won't catch me wearing leggings. And they are 20% off. Next, Vital Seamless. I have such a big love for Vital Seamless. <laughs> so the black shorts are on sale. They're 20% off. And then the matching sports bra as well is 20% off. These I would say are relatively low support, but if you've got relatively same boobs as me, I think they're fine. I wear them all the time and don't struggle at all. Maybe if I'm doing like a really high intense Heat workout, which I never do. <laughs> I wouldn't go for that, but for strength, Pilates, walks, and just like everyday living, I think these are perfect. Plus, just classic. So yeah, those are both 20% off. Then in the Vital Seamless as well, we've got the grey. Again, classic. Like I feel like you need a black set and you need a grey set. You know what I'm saying? These are 20% off, obviously. And then we've got the matching sports bra as well. I like the um like the shading around the boobs. I think it's really flattering. This one's 20% off as well. Another top that you guys have definitely seen me wear quite a lot. It's this white one. I tie it up on the side because I think it just gives it a bit of shape. It's the softest material ever. Ooh, 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 ooh. Wow. This is the essential tea. It's also in black, which I don't have, but I actually really want to get. And the essential teas are 10% off. Then we have the Fit Collection, which I actually personally think is kind of underrated. They have like a sticky thing on the band, so they do not roll down. Literally, when you put them on, they don't move. They're much shorter, so they're more of like a booty short, but I personally love them. I think what I love even more is, this is inside out, the Fit Sports Bras. I think these are so comfy. The thick band, I just love. I think it's so, so flattering. And we have Adapt Mal, which is one of my favorites. Oh, I say this about everything. Like I said, everything that's on sale in this sale is Genuinely all my favorite stuff from Gymshark. These crops are so comfy and so flattering. I love them. This one is 20% off as well as the leggings. These actually are quite new for me. These are the training loose fit shorts, I think. Yeah, fit shorts. So comfy. They have that like a bit of stickiness on the band as well. So they don't move at all. Perfect for running, going on walks lounging super super comfy and i feel like these shorts are always very unflattering on me these ones are actually quite flattering so highly recommend these they are 20 percent off last thing this isn't all the sale items as well there is a load more but these are just my favorites the ruched sports bra absolutely i love these this pink one is 30 percent off which is very ideal. They have like an olive green and a blue as well, which is stunning. I will make sure to put all of the dates and times on the screen here. If you did want to be reminded of the sale just before it goes live, definitely make sure to head over to my Instagram. I'll be posting swipe ups on the day to specific items. And I'll have like a little reminder thing that you can tap and get reminded of when the sale goes live. But yeah, anyway, now I am going to quickly 
get a bag ready, pack up my laptop and head out to a cafe, I think, to do some work for a couple of hours. I will be picking Sam up from work. The cafe I want to go to is super close to his work, so I thought it'd be the perfect excuse to take myself out for lunch, do some work. But yeah, I'm getting a bit peckish, so I'm gonna get ready and head out now. up at the cafe now I've had some lunch it was quite small I'm not gonna lie so I'm not completely full <laughs> I might go get a snack but I actually managed to get quite a few emails done and a whole segment of my video edited already which is great very proud of myself I definitely want to start doing that more um, okay I just feel like I'm so much more productive when there's no distractions or when I'm there to work. Just before I go pick Sam up, because I think I've got another like 15 minutes, I'm just going to, which is very close to the cafe, which is ideal, I'm just pulling in now, just going to pull into Chemist Warehouse real quick because I am out of one of my skincare products. So <laughs> the lighting is very yellow because anyone who knows Chemist Warehouse, it is very yellow. <laughs> also thinking they might have some sort of protein bar or snack in there because I am definitely still hungry. So I'll keep you updated on what I find. Got my Effacla duo from La Roche. Love this one. I feel like it's just always whenever my skin's starting to just like not love me, that just helps. I feel like especially with little pimples. I've been getting little pimples up there. I think they're sweat pimples, but I feel like using that definitely helps. I didn't find any snacks that tickle my fancy if I'm completely honest. So I got some gum. Because I want a breath refresh. Mm. You know what a piece of gum is just, just exactly what you feel like. I'm going to go pick Sam up. I do want to go to the gym at some point today. Equally, it's a very rainy, miserable day. And it also is the last thing I feel like doing. So if we get there, we get there. If we don't, we don't. <laughs> tonight we have made basically like what would you call it like DIY nachos yeah this recipe is actually in my ebook as well it's very very simple delish are you excited yeah yeah oh. I'm very excited this looks amazing mm. peach. peach oh I don't know which one do you want uh, I might try peach which one I want. Remedy was so generous and sent all of this kombucha. I've also, we've had a lot so far. Thank you, Remedy. Thank you, Remedy. Yeah, oh. I think I'm gonna try peach though, because I haven't tried this one. I don't know. <laughs> Go peach. Pick one for me. Just pick one, not gingerly. Okay. Apple crisp? No. No, 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 mint. <laughs> I knew we wouldn't like that one. <laughs> Why would you make me choose? Well, see, it was a test and you chose wrong. <laughs> Shmody! Your dad is so silly. Oh.
look kind of freaky right now. My face mask is like half dried and I can't really make that many expressions. But just as I was drinking my coffee, planning my day a little bit, this came in the post. I was just about to open it and then I was like, I should film this. So, oh my goodness, look at that. Firstly, we've got a book. This is so Feminists don't wear pink and other lies. Amazing women on what the F word means to them. I'm assuming this box is basically, yep, yeah, okay. All around International Women's Day that's just passed. Some socks that say Gymshark on them. That's incredible. I always need new socks. Oh, oh no. They're spilling everywhere. If you think you can't do it, it's up to you to make sure you do. We do not stray away from challenge. That's when we really thrive. Together, we move. I should go wash this off. I look like a freak. I've fully got it in my eyebrows too. <laughs> oh, look at focus to start off with. But look at the pores. <gasps> That's crazy. Apologies, I forgot my camera. Just picked Sam up from work. We want to pick up some takeaway because it's Friday, so obviously we're having takeaway for dinner. But it's a bit early because it's like four or something. So we thought we'd kill some time by just having a bit of a Kmart shop and then we'll pick up dinner. We don't know what we want. Should we get a 1.5 litre deep fryer or a 3 litre deep fryer? I don't know. How much do you want to be deep frying? Not that much, maybe just a 1.5. I have just picked up some more glasses because we have broken a lot of ours lately. And these ones were $6. For six. Like battered fish? Yeah. <gasps> that would be Now you want to eat fry, don't you? We're getting one. You want That's you. Bread maker. <laughs> am I the bread maker, am I? Yeah. You also need Post a new it. bin because our bin is broken is. and kind of stinks. It's 40 something bucks and I know the other one was 40 something. Or okay. it was 60. Might have been 60. <laughs> Your face just said, it might have been 60. Well, it might have been. <laughs> We are currently on our way to all the ocean looks stunning. We should definitely go for a swim later on. We're on our way to the food shop to do our weekly grocery also shop. Also known as Woolworths. Also known as Woolworths, yes. The food yes. shop. <laughs> I don't think anyone called it that. Well, you know. The supermarket. Yeah, I didn't know what to call it. Supermarket. The food shop. <laughs> Shut up. Food shop. We're on our way to the food shop. Is it the shop? Is that wrong? Food? Absolutely not. <laughs> I am actually going away next Wednesday, so I'm actually not going to be here all of next, like most of next week. But we've still got to plan like today's food, tomorrow's food, and then Monday, Tuesday before I go. You know what we haven't done? What have we done? Planned our dinners. We never do. I know we did last week, and it was actually really good. Okay, dinners for the week. Are we ready? Oh my god. Do we want to make the TikTok pasta again? That was so good. Oh my god. And it's so easy. Okay. Do it. Okay. Not tonight, tomorrow night, Monday night, Tuesday night. Yes. Kind of craving pizza. We can make pizza tonight. Although we made pizza a few weeks ago, and it was really bad. We ruined pizza for us. Yeah, and we're like, mm. well, I don't know. I'm like really go, like, full at the pizza. moment, so I'm struggling to like think about we'll dinners. Be better. Have you seen that TikTok? It's like. Um, doing something that's like dangerous. <laughs> You're yeah. so dangerous. Like when you stand up for yourself mm. and then you like tough and then you turn around and go. Oh, yeah. yeah, when you do a phone call or something. Yeah, when you call the doctor <laughs> and book your own so appointment. Dangerous. <laughs> We've got TikTok pasta. Pasta. Do we want to do pizza? Like a good pizza this no, time? No, that's too much Italian. <laughs> okay. Take your kid to the show. It is, honestly. Okay, could we do pizza tonight? No. Oh. Yeah. Okay, well give me some more options. Um, if anyone has some recommendations for dinners, please leave them below because this is a weekly struggle for us. It is. I just don't know, you know when you're full 
you, do you guys get full and then struggle to think of meals to eat? Yeah, you can't think of what you feel like. Like, when you're hungry, you're like, oh, yeah, I could have this, this, this. Yeah. But when you're full, you're like, I don't feel like food. No. That's yucky. Oh, we can just do fish then, yeah. Fish and chips? Okay. Maybe a cheeky salad. Fish and salad. Yeah, like an Asian salad. What would we need Crispy for that? Crispy Asian salad. Alright, that's two dinners. We need two more. Mmm! Just hide behind that? No, because then we'll walk around for half an hour being like. Mm -hmm. But I need to see. No, never. It never works. We always say we're gonna do it, and it never works. Do you like my hair like this? Like I've been doing this slicked look quite I, a bit lately. You know I like your hair up. Do you? Yeah. But do you like like the behind the ears yeah. slicked? Yeah. Okay. I, I like your hair in buns and ponytails. Well, you know I've never seen you with a oh. with a bun ponytail. I always wear ponytails. Like a, oh, a low a ponytail. classic. Where do you wear ponytail? Like up here. Like a high ponytail. Do you? Yes, always to the gym and around the house. I always thought you just wore it in a bun. No. Oh. Huh. <laughs> mm, think I fucked up my soup. <laughs> what the fuck? Let's just go and have a look. <laughs> this is I'm not going to go well, but I'm let's sick go. of this sucky ass, stinky car. Stinky? My car is not stinky. <laughs> Oh. Um, uh, Alex, can you please go to the desk? Um, <laughs> we have decided on our other two dinners. We are doing my pumpkin mac and cheese from my ebook, and what are we doing? Quesadillas, quesadillas as well. Yeah. So that means quesadillas. So that means for the week or for the four nights, we're doing quesadillas, mac and cheese, pasta. What was the other one that we said we were going to do? I don't know. Now I've forgotten. That's the point. Oh, of fish and chips and salad. Oh yeah, so we need some fish. So we need, to be, we need to go back to the ad section. I love doing these. Can we do these with our fish and chips? Sure. I have been trying to find some gluten-free hot cross buns for ages because I've been trying gluten-free out for the last month, which I can explain in another video. Basically, it's for my period of pain. I'm doing a lot of research and someone said to try and cut out gluten, see if that helps. Anyway, long story short, I'm trying to find gluten-free hot cross buns and I can't find them anywhere. They don't have any. They don't have any here. I've already stocked up on this drink. It's on sale right now. PSA. The next bar, raspberry sand, <laughs> just pushing me. <laughs> raspberry and kiwi mineral water. It's 185 right now. PSA. Everyone needs to get on it. It's so good. Did you ever have poppers at school? Yeah. Which ones? Which ones were your favourite? I think mine was always apple black currant. And did you ever like freeze apple them? Apple black currant. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, sunshine punch is the best one. No, apple black Gold currant. Ash, I'm sorry. Yeah, that was I'm the best. Sorry. Shop. High five. Suck. Sus. We did pretty well actually. Apologies, my camera just died. Oh. So now we've changed to the phone. Sam is stopping through Mackie G's. To get a coffee. To get a coffee, of course. Hi there, what can I get for you? G'day, uh, can I just get a small ice latte? Go to Thanks, mate. Thank you. Good, mate. How are you? Things that aren't illegal but should be. Mm. It's like introducing yourself to Mackie's drive through. And he pulls up, he's like, hey, welcome to Macca's, what can I get you? He's like, ah, oh, g'day, mate, it's Dean here. Um, can I get? <laughs> I like that. It's Dean here. And it's like, I didn't ask. I want to do it. It's like, thanks, like, thank I should you. know who yeah. I am, yeah. Thanks for asking if I wanted anything. I'd love to shake your hash brown. No, you wouldn't. <laughs> oh, did you want anything? No. Sorry, I didn't actually ask. I, a lot didn't. of the time, I just presume you didn't want anything. Well, I would From... say something if I did. Yeah. It is now 5 p.m. Yes, it is. <laughs> nice. doesn't feel like that. Um, 
I can't, this, these glasses, I cannot see the screen, it's so good. <laughs> we are currently on our way to the basketball court, which I'm really, like, I never thought I'd be saying, but so quite excited. So excited. bringing out her in a high school musical, Wildcats. <laughs> I <am>. 16, <laughs> 16. I literally, I'm just going to say it now, don't expect much, because I haven't played basketball probably since about grade nine. And that was when I was forced to in a sport class. So. Yeah, to be honest, same. I just thought it would be a good way to get some fitness and a fun thing to do, a fun little activity to do. You're competitive. I am competitive. Even with yourself. Yes. So you'll so be So I like... want to come every single day to get better. Yeah, you'll be like... When lockdown first started, we were doing a lot more of this kind of stuff and we kind of stopped ever since gyms opened up again. And I really like doing it. It's just a really good way to kind of get out, get some fresh air. Oh, oh no. The whole outfit actually that I'm wearing as well is part of the Afterpay sale that's going live on the 18th. See it in a bit of action. This is what we're working with. Try! I know I can, oh, pressure, oh, nice. Wish me up, because I'm not going to be good. You want to aim for that black square? Yeah. Be like, this, is, this will be you, betcha. <laughs> right? <laughs> Works. Okay. If you actually get It works. <laughs> nice. Yeah, well that's nice. How do you was, feel? That was actually... It was a hard like, workout. Well, it's just very hot and... <laughs> Sam cardio. really hates when it's just hot. That was good though. I actually had a lot of fun. I feel like... I'm buggered. I haven't done cardio in so long. Same, honestly. It was actually a really good workout because I didn't even think about working out whilst we were there. You know at the gym and you're like... Yeah, oh, yeah. We were just having fun. How good is that just like to add into our... A couple oh, yeah. times a week. I feel like it's good for your mental health and physical health, cardio. It just makes you feel good. We didn't bring water because we were like, yeah, yeah, yeah whatever. I know, yeah, now we I'm didn't like, bring water. Oh, that was a big mistake. I feel like, did I click something? Now it's more like fish-eyed. Or like more, I don't know. Usually when I was logging, it's like here. But now it's like, I kind of like it. I don't know what I clicked, but I like it. Go home, have a shower, have dinner. Have you got something to tell me? No? <laughs> Those chicken wings really uh, went straight to my gut. <laughs> Ocean swim, which was lovely. Sam, in his new air, oh, I was gonna say air fryer, no, deep yeah. fryer, has just made some churros. Churros? Churros? Tempted churros. Yeah. We don't have the right equipment. Yes. Basically, donuts, sticks. How are we they? Is it really good? Sorry, this lighting really isn't the best. Oh, it's so fluffy. It's like a donut, hey? Oh, it's thick. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of because it's been in the bowl. Kind of like got hard again. Mm. I kind of scoop it like this is a spoon and scoop the chop. Right. I'm still not sure about this camera. Please let me know if you prefer this one, the Sony or the Canon in the comments below. I will not be offended if you say Canon. I feel like I love this one in good lighting, but in low light, it's just so bad. 
I don't know why you would think it being made for vlogging it would be really good at like recorrecting itself but I've just been editing this vlog chilling having a very slow Sunday which has been lovely it is a very long vlog <laughs> like it's definitely over 40 minutes so apologies for that but I personally love watching long vlogs so I hope you guys have enjoyed we will see you next week for a very exciting vlog I'm very excited for next week bye I'm not yeah I'm leaving no. bye